Yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's a bit better one. Have a look at the size of that for an Aussie bass. Welcome to another outdoor adventure. Dan's taken me on a wild goose chase through the uh, bushland of East Gippsland. Apparently you've got to be a mountain goat. Anyway, we're on the search for Australian bass and well, it's fair to say there's no easy way about doing this. <laughs> If you want to catch them. Oh, I just got the ooh. Oh. Walking up alongside this deep pool, rugged terrain. Hopefully it leads us somewhere where we might get a fish. I've already fished the bottom section. Missed a couple, caught a couple. They're all small. But this is starting to look a bit promising. Anyway, let's keep trekking. Or mountain climbing. One of the two. Well, after all that pushing, hiking, <laughs> rowing, second cast. Come on, this beautiful pool. It's only a small fish, but that doesn't matter. That's worth it. I've been fishing top water, but I thought I'd put on this little duo rallus. Cranked it down next to that snag. And got a nice little Aussie bass. I don't want to rock this thing around because otherwise, guess where we're going? <laughs> Gotta be happy with that. I'm sure there's a big one around here somewhere. Let's find him. Let's drop this one in. Say it, pal. Say it, pal. Yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. And a bit better one. I don't know how I've hooked him, but. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Huh? Yeah, mate. Oh, 
I might be with this. Let's get over there. Oh, he's going to a snag. Hang on, hang on, hang on, stop, stop, stop. I'm gonna say that, my friends, is what we came paddling all the way up this river. Rapids, you name it. Have a look at the size of that for an Aussie bass. That duo just got absolutely engulfed. Oh man, I'm trembling with excitement. That's my PB. That is an absolute beast of a fish. They're nice and hardy too, which is good. So I'm gonna get him back in the water, but just get another couple of photos first. After releasing that, uh, that larger fish just before, we've just popped back out to fish that same spot. And um, I just was working the snags and I thought, oh no, I'll just put one out in the middle. There's a lot of timber down here, but there you go. Another nice little bass. Here's the little bubba one. Uh, glad I got mum before. Anyway. Whoop. Doing the job. That is a Kraken lure today. Duo, duo Rallis. Good part about it, it's a mid-water diver too, so. I'm not touching bottom, but I'm definitely getting that lure down amongst the, the timber. I can feel it brush across it every now and again. Just sort of pause, just let it come up and just crank it again. And of course, it's finding that Mark and those little fishies are eating it. So, whoa, 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 that's, and that's a snag, but it's all good. Let's keep working and working and working.